across the known world, there is an insidious substance which is destroying the minds of today's teens. This substance, often called booze, hooch, or firewater, is everywhere. At school, in the playground, and yes, even in the home. Meet Bobby. Bobby is going to high school for the first time. He's a little nervous. But because he has the support of his parents, his friends, Bobby knows he'll be fine. Bobby also knows there will be many new challenges in high school. Unfortunately, the one Bobby is least prepared for is alcohol. That's right, alcohol. The temptation is everywhere. There is no doubt that alcohol is ruining the lives of today's youth. It's poisoning their minds and their precious bodily fluids. And it must be stopped now. In high school, there will be pressures to drink alcohol. Hey, Bobby, you're really cute. You want to try some alcohol? I don't know. I heard that alcohol is bad for you. Come on, Bobby. All the cool kids are doing it. Maybe I should ask my parents. OK. Alcohol can even be found at home. Even one sip of alcohol can cause a loss of bodily function and a lack of good judgment. It can even cause Death. So if you're thinking of trying alcohol, think again. What happened to Bobby could happen to you. It can be anywhere. It can be their college town. It can be their hometown. Slip off to a party one night. Alcohol becomes readily accessible to them. They start drinking. You have peer pressure. You're drunk, but you want to be drunker, and somebody dares you. The next thing you know, they've had way too much, and they're not their normal selves. I wasn't thinking smart. I wasn't thinking about what the consequences could be. Alcohol is a toxin. It's a poison. There's no way around it. Kids are not invincible. No one is invincible. Binge drinking can give you a buzz on its way to killing you. We have been to, to deaths that were strictly alcohol poisoned. They couldn't move him, and they weren't sure he was breathing. That's when the 911 call was made. It happens every year to somebody that thought it wouldn't happen to them. I just miss him a lot.